Hi everyone, so I'm just making this quick video discussing how, uh, you know, there's proof that, um, God put signs in your life that he's guiding you and looking over you. I didn't realize this till much later, but it just so happens, the coincidence, I realize that, um, both spiders and octopi are are solitary creatures. And INTJ them is solitary and so is INFJ, maybe to a little lesser degree, they in the sense that they can that usually work with other people to achieve their goals, but they're generally very solitary. So I made Alec Ned a mud rider, a humanoid humanoid spider, and um Tanji Reen were Tangelarine, um, a Cecilia, a half-human, half-octopus. So yeah, so it's pretty neat how God puts things in, in science in our life that he's leading you and guiding you and, um, watching over you. Uh, leading you on the right path. So just, while you do, do for God, put your trust in him, don't worry, do all your work for him and he'll show you the way. He'll lead you and make your path straight. Don't worry about accomplishing your goals. It all go according to God's plan. Just put your faith and trust in Him. Give your project to Him and He will transform it into what He sees fit. Just, just lay it all over to God. Now, okay, God bless you guys and God bless you with you and your households. Bye. Oh yeah, and uh, Isla actually was directly inspired by um, Iris from Ruby Gloom. Um, I don't think Nuki was really directly inspired by anything. Uh, I just wanted to make a male Cyclops too. That was cute. Though I may have gotten the idea for his freckle, for his freckles from uh, Princess Morbucks from the Powerpuff Girls. Alright, bye.